The federal government has announced a multi-million dollar package for customers of a failed funeral insurer. Eupla, as it's now known, collapsed in March, leaving thousands of First Nations customers without cover. Here's National Consumer Affairs reporter Amy Bainbridge. It's been an uncertain few months for Eupla customers like James Frederick Creed from Yarrabah in far north Queensland. He paid into the funeral fund for decades. $100 a fortnight for the last maybe 20 years, and that's a lot of money. I blame the government because, like I said, they should have kept an eye on them. Now the government is stepping in. Eupla has breached moral responsibility it has breached cultural responsibility. The government will pay funeral claims to customers who had an active policy on the 1st of April 2020. The interim measure will be available until the 30th of November next year. The average policy is worth $8,000. The first eligible claims will be paid within weeks. It's not the full answer, but it's a good way to dealing with the first tranche and the most important thing that we feel and that is families that are grieving, that cannot bury their people. While the announcement will cover claims for eligible policyholders, it doesn't deal with the issue of compensation for customers who haven't yet needed to claim, but who may have paid thousands to keep their policies active. We've got 18 months, we're going to continue to push the issues that need to be pushed to make sure everybody who's been hurt has been covered. The 2018 Royal Commission revealed customers signed up for policies incorrectly believing the company was Aboriginal owned and run. New rules in the wake of the Royal Commission meant the company hadn't been able to sell new policies since April 2020. It eventually collapsed. We'll certainly be asking hard questions of the regulators and of uh, the agencies about exactly what was known and when. Customers are being encouraged to sign up to the Treasury website for updates. Amy Bainbridge, ABC News. Australia